Hi, this is Jake with another Onshape tech tip. Wire routing can be done in many different ways inside of Onshape. One of those ways is to use the wire and custom feature. To start, you can select sketch points to define the endpoints of your wire. After choosing starting and ending directions, you can edit the straightness of the wire to make sure that it bends properly to fit the needs of your design. Like many other feature workflows in Onshape, Make connectors can also be used in the place of sketch points. In this case, you can use make connectors to define the endpoints of a wire and then go through the same steps shown when using points. When choosing the size of your wire, you can either use a custom diameter or a standard wire gauge. In addition to using points to define your wire, you can also use curves. Here, I've used the freeform spline custom feature to create a free flowing curve to build the wire along. If you need to edit the curvature of the wire at any point, move the spline points to their desired location and then update your wire. For a more structured approach to wiring with curves, use a projected curve to set the guidelines for your wire. You can select all the points that are included with it and then create a wire based off of those. Be sure to test out the bundling options included in the tool, which can be used for putting multiple wires along the same path. Wiring is one of the many custom features in the Onshape library, so check it out and stay tuned for more tech tips.